everyone, so August is over, which means it's time for an August favorites video. Now, today's favorites video is going to be different than most of my favorites videos. Normally, I show you guys my favorite makeup products of the month. This time, I'm not only showing you my favorite makeup products, I have a hair product, I have some fun things like my favorite TV show and music of the month, so I'm kind of switching it up a little bit. Comment below and let me know if you want me to keep doing favorite videos like this, where I kind of talk about my favorite everything of the month, or if you want me to just go back to doing my favorite makeup products of the month. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, the first thing is my NARS powder foundation. This is in the color Fiji, and I have used quite a bit of it, if you can't tell, which you probably can because I've hit pan. I like to use this over my Laura Mercier Silk Cream Foundation. I've had that in favorite videos a lot, but normally I would set it with a translucent powder. Now I'm setting it with a powder foundation, which gives me a lot more coverage, and I really like it, and I do need a lot of coverage. You know, I don't have the greatest skin, so I really like using this powder foundation to set my makeup with. The next thing is the Lancome Hypnose Drama Mascara. I have it on today. It makes my lashes so bold, so long. I had this on in my How To Make Your Eyeliner Last All Day video, and everyone was asking me what mascara I was wearing, and it was this one. I've worn this, I think, every single day of the month. So, yeah, that's why my lashes have been looking really long, and I think they look really pretty. So, it has a really cool wand. I'll show you guys. It's like, hold on, focus. So, see how it's kind of like wavy? I think that's so cool. So this has definitely been my favorite mascara of the month. Now, I got this, you might have seen this in my Ulta haul video, so I got this towards the end of August, but it is the Too Faced Natural Eye Palette, and it comes with all of these colors. So it comes with lots and lots of colors, and I've been using this every day since I opened this in my Ulta haul video, and I don't know if you guys can tell, but this is the eye that I've been wearing. People have been asking me to do a tutorial. It's really simple. I'm just mixing these two and putting them on my lid, putting this in my highlight, and then using this one, this one, and this one in my crease, and that's all I've been doing. It's really fast, really easy. I can literally do my eyes in like 2.5 seconds and I think it's great. This is also good if you're traveling, you have all of your shadows right here and you don't have to worry about taking, you know, this one from this collection, this one from this company, you know, it's nice that it's all together. So the next thing I'm talking about is a nail polish. This is Ella Fantastic Pink by OPI. I really like it. It's not as bright pink as I've normally been wearing. Now I don't have anything on my nails right now, which is kind of embarrassing, but I have it on my toes, which you guys can't see. Ugh. But I do have it on my toes, and um, I think this is a really, really pretty pink color, and I really like it, and I got it at Ulta a while back, and I never really liked it because it wasn't as bright pink as I liked, but I kind of like it. How many times did I just say like in that sentence? I don't know, but I kind of like it because it's not so bright pink, and it's better, I feel, for fall, so I am going to be wearing this a whole lot. My next favorite is what I've been wearing on my lips. I've been wearing this a lot. If you have watched one of my recent videos, I can guarantee that this is what's been on my lips. So what I've been wearing is Subculture Lip Liner by MAC. It looks like this. My camera's being mean and it doesn't like focusing and I don't like that. Okay, and then I've been using Lazy Day Lipstick by MAC. Now this was from the To The Beach collection, so I don't think you can get it anymore, but it's just a very mauve, kind of like rose pink that is really sheer and pretty, but it definitely gives the color. And then I've been using this lip gloss from Forever 21. It came in a pack of four for $4.80, which is absolutely amazing because for a little over a dollar, you get four lip glosses, and I like to put one in my purse, put one at my makeup station, put one in my car. That way, no matter what, you always have a lip gloss with you. And this is like the pink sparkly one. It doesn't have a name because it comes in a group, but there's like a white one, a hotter pink one, a babier pink one, and like a nectar kind of color. Um, and this is the babier pink sparkly one. And I've been putting this just on the middle of my bottom lip and then going like this. And that is it. I'm not putting lip gloss around the edges of my mouth. Here, I'll show you guys because that's like fun, right? Just like this. That's all I've been doing. And it's supposed to make your lips look like bigger and fuller. I don't really know if it does, but I actually like the effect of not having all over glossy lips just in the middle. I think it's pretty. Okay, so the next thing I have as like my favorite product to hold up and show is actually scissors. And that's just because I wanted to remember to tell you guys that I've really been into trimming my eyebrows. Not too long ago, probably beginning of August, I trimmed my own eyebrows. I threaded them and I tweezed them and I got them to a shape that I really, really like. 
I like the way, how many times have I said like in this video? Oh my gosh, but I do like the arch that I created and I think it's a fun mix up and I think I've gotten them pretty even. I've been using Espresso by MAC to fill them in and my Espresso is like getting down to the wire. I've been using it for my eyebrows every single day. I use it in my crease sometimes. I use it on my um, lash line as a liner sometimes. It's a really great color. So Espresso by MAC is another favorite of this month. But um, yeah, so trimming my eyebrows is my new favorite eyebrow thing. Okay, for hair, I have my Oscar Blondie Pronto Gloss. And this has kind of taken the place of my Chi Silk Infusion. I still use my Redken Satin Wear because it is a blow dry lotion that protects my hair from the heat of the blow dryer because the um, heat protectant that I spray in my hair, I don't spray until it's dry, but what's going to protect it from the blow dryer? The Redken Satin Wear. Now I put this in after I put the Redken Satin Wear in before I blow dried my hair and it really just, it makes my hair feel really good. It makes it really shiny and glossy and I really like it. So yeah, that's a favorite of this month. Those are all of the beauty product favorites for the month, but I have some other favorites that I wanted to talk to you guys about. So my favorite TV show of the month has to be, hands down, no doubt about it, Big Brother. Who do you guys want to win? I'm kind of rooting for Brittany because she's really, really funny and I kind of really like her. I'm rooting for Brittany. Um, who do you guys want to win? Also, Keeping Up with the Kardashians came back this month. You guys know that I absolutely adore that show. So obviously that has to go in this category, but I actually like Big Brother better. And I think it's just because I've gotten so into it that I just like want to finish it out. But um, I'm actually really excited that Keeping Up with the Kardashians started again because I do like that. My favorite song of the month would have to be Magic by B.O.B. featuring River Comos or something. I don't know. I probably just butchered that name. I think that is one of the funnest songs to blast in your car or in your room while you're getting ready, and I just like to dance around to it. I also have really been liking Miley Cyrus's new CD. Her songs are a little bit slower. They're not as fun to like get up and jump around to, but I do like them. I think she has a really pretty voice. And the last one is Justin Bieber. Now, I get asked all the time if I like Justin Bieber. I do. I definitely like his songs. My favorite ones this month have been That Should Be Me and Stuck in the Moment. I really like his like slower songs because he does have a pretty good voice, actually a really good voice. But I definitely think that I'm going to support him forever through anything he does, no matter what, because he started off on YouTube. And I think us YouTubers need to stick together. I don't like this whole, oh, we're competition business. I think that's silly, and I completely support him in everything that he does. But I've really been enjoying his music this month. Okay, I've also been really liking this necklace. It's like a purple and blue kind of stone, and I'm wearing a purple and blue top, and it has matching earrings. My grandmother got this for me a while back, and I didn't start wearing it immediately. I don't know why. I think it just kind of went to the bottom of my jewelry, and then I was always wearing other things. And then in August, I started wearing this, and I really like it. I've been getting so many compliments on it. She got it from someone who, like, makes them in her retirement home or something. She told me this really cool story about how this lady makes them, but I thought they were really cool and no two are the same so it's like I have a little piece of something that like no one else in the world has which is like not cool but it's just like exciting you know and I like the little earrings that go with it so thank you grandmother I really do like these and then the last thing is my diet ocean spray cranberry juice now I love cranberry juice but it actually has a lot of calories in it you can't just go drinking glasses whenever you want to and that's one of my biggest problems with you know, making sure that I kind of keep in shape. It's that I like to drink my calories. And so I found that this only has 10 calories in it, right? Yeah, 10 calories in it. I can pretty much drink as many of these as I want, and I really like that. Now, I'm not trying to spread like, oh, everyone needs to count their calories, nothing like that. But I am someone who, you know, if I have a milkshake, I never think that that's like something substantial. You know what I mean? But it is. Okay, so those are my favorites. Let me know in the comments below if you like this kind better or if you just want me to go back to doing beauty products. It's whatever you guys want to see. And also, leave me a video response letting me know what your favorites for the month of August were. I would love to watch it if you don't have a camera or you can't leave a video response. Just leave it in the comments below and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye!